Hello everybody in YouTube, this is Justin the Snap-on Junkie and today I'm going to talk about crow's feet, uh, what are they, how they work, and uh, kind of what they're designed to do. So um, this is a crow's feet, okay, and what this is kind of designed to do is be like an ultra stubby wrench. So as you can see here, they have a complete flat side and this is what you want to put down like towards your project if you will so it goes like this and then the raised side uh that's you know you want to have that facing towards you and what you can do is you can put in extensions on these things okay and then you can put a ratchet on there and what it does is it just lets you have less you know you can get into tighter spots because you're now your wrench isn't so long so that's one of the things so I made this demonstration to kind of show you guys a whole bunch of different stuff and like what they're used for and uh, you know some of the advantages of owning these and some accessories that you can get to make it more versatile. So uh, what this is on the bottom here, this is like uh, an oil pressure sending unit out of a Cummins, okay? And where this is located in the block, uh, it's on the driver's side and it's down like in between uh, it's on the lower part of the block by the cam and uh, the frame rail kind of runs right here and then this there's a wire that comes out so to to take this apart you either need uh, a wrench and then you have to be on an angle and maybe you could damage it or whatever but a deep socket is what you need so you don't damage your plastic piece putting it back in and then I mean, these things aren't cheap, you know how much expensive sensors are. And sometimes maybe this is a four wire plug where this plug is wider than the actual fastener and then you can't get a socket over it, you know what I'm saying? And you have to buy either a modified socket or whatever. But these crow's feet, what you can do, okay, is again, you would take like, you know, your put your extension on there or you can use it without an extension, okay? And you can take your ratchet, okay? And let's just say, you know, you can only get on it straight down, if you will. Then you just turn it loose and you can keep coming back to it, you know? But if you have enough room to swing all the way around, what you can do is just move your ratchet like this, okay? And if you had a longer extension, you could just keep moving it all the way around. So that's one way that the crow's feet work. And that's a, you know, a good thing to have. So then you can just reach down there and spin this out and it'll work on tightening it too. So put that over there. Okay, now the next thing that these things are good for is uh, crow's feet are good to have is like if you have power steering lines or any type of thing with a line in, you know, you can take your, you can take your, uh, you know, they make these in line wrenches too, but the hole is never really wide enough to get over some hoses. Like the hoses is just as big as the, you know, the fastener, so you can't get these over. So what you can do is you take your crow's feet again, okay, and you put them on there. And now, you know, you can get into pretty tight spots when you're working on airlines or power steering lines or anything like that and you can get it spun out so that's another thing that you can do now like uh if this let's just say that you're working on like uh headers or you know what i'm saying some head bolts you know they're in pretty tight spots like they're on the inside or you know they're they got a header right here and you can't really get a wrench on there or a socket you know because you got all the extensions and stuff so what you can do okay is you take this on there okay and then they sell these different like this is just these little accessories and what it does is, is it lets you put it in there okay and now what you made is you can see you can take your extension you know a longer one and it let you got it lets you get clearance to come in here and loosen your header bolt or whatever 
you know, then you can re-ratchet it around, you know, and it lets you clear it to get your header bolt on or whatever. So, you know, I don't know if a lot of people know that they make these little, like, little, you know what I'm saying? They come in a set and you can get them to go, you know, either direction or whatever like that. And also what you can do is if you're, you know, like, uh, you got a bunch of room, but the bolt is really tight. So what you can do is you can take your breaker bar, okay, put that on your crow's foot, okay, and now what you got is a really long lever to break the bolt loose so you don't have to get, you know, two wrenches like this. You know, and you got all this shit, you know, that becomes pretty long and then it's all in the way. So, you know, that's another advantage of having a crow's feet and like what you use them for and things like that. And then also, <clears throat> you know, like with these accessories, okay, you can put this on there. Okay, and now what you have is you can put it on there and you can torque with these, okay? So if you were in a tight spot and you needed to get the fastener torqued, you could come down, you know, and torque it. Now with the torque, you know what I'm saying, you want to keep it as straight as possible, you know, and now you got, you know, you can put a torque wrench on there if you can't get a socket on it or whatever you can use these crow's feet you know and that's why this is raised like this a little bit <clears throat> and you know what i'm saying like uh how they have this raised up is so you can automatically you know put this on there and you can see here that you have some good distance so you can clear like if the bolt was too long or whatever and they also work on studs um you know if you had a stud that's on there pretty long or whatever and you don't have a deep enough socket you could put this on there and get the you know fastener loosened to get it back to whatever and a lot of different companies make these uh, you know what I'm saying but like you can see that the snap-on ones are pretty thin so they're you know designed to get into tight spots so that's really about crow's feet uh, you know I'm sure if you guys have any other uses for them you could put it down in the uh in the comments section and i'll take a look because you know that's what these videos are for just to show you a bunch of different tools just kind of show you how i use them uh how they're designed to work i guess in my opinion but i'm sure that there'll be people out there that say you know that i'm stupid and i don't use tools and i don't know how to do this stuff but you know i'm trying to come up with you know you know, just show you different things that is out there so you guys can, you know, choose to buy it or not. Or maybe you run in a situation where you need this type of stuff. So it's just a bunch of different little things on how to use crow's feet. So uh, thank you for today, guys.